Hi everyone and welcome to the next day of the IOTD that is image of the day daily at 10 pm on the YouTube channel. Yesterday if you remember we discussed a renal mass and that was oncocytoma that is a benign tumor and today we are going to discuss the another renal mass and that happens to be a malignant tumor and I think all of you have immediately jumped to a diagnosis. If I say this is a renal mass, all of you have told me it is clear cell RCC. So the word suggests itself, no brownie points for that. Clear cell means that all the cells are looking whitish, cytoplasm is white. If I see a higher par, again all the cells are looking clear and white. So my question to you is why are they clear? So remember, these cells are clear because they show you deposition of glycogen and lipids. So indirectly, if I ask you what is the special stain for glycogen which will come positive over here, will be pass. And what is the special stain for lipids that's going to come over here and that's going to be oil red O. So that is clear cell RCC. Let me move on to the next tumor. This is again a renal tumor and I think it's got something very characteristic out here. So all of you can appreciate that this has number one, it has these papillae. This has finger like projections called papillae. And number two, it has this round brown uh, bluish color body. So what is that? So these papillae that I was talking about over here, this happens to be a papillary renal cell carcinoma, papillary variant. And the next thing is that what are these round blue color bodies? These are calcification. These are samoma bodies. Now guys, your homework for the day is you are going to enumerate all those things in pathology where we can see a samoma body. And I'll, give, I'll tell you exactly how many things you need to enumerate. So the mnemonic of that is PSM square. So you're going to tell me two P's, two S and two M's. So PSMM. So remember PSM square, I'm waiting to... Uh, look at those six diseases or tumors where you're going to tell me the samoma body formation. And this is what it looks like. One of them happens to be P for papillary RCC. Moving on to the third renal tumor that can come to you in the exam is this. And this is the one which is very commonly confused with clear cell. But this is not clear cell. This is chromophobe RCC. It's the best prognostically the breast renal cell carcinoma. So guys, over here, look at the cells. First, I'll zoom in and show you one cell. So if you see, the cell has a very, very well-defined outline. If you remember, in our biology practicals in school, these are the kind of plant cells that we used to draw with our pencils, right? So the outlines were very, very well-defined. So that's why we call them plant cells. Number two, if you look at the nucleus, it's extremely dark. So you call it a raisinoid nucleus. That's the next feature. And thirdly, if you see, look very carefully, that's the catch point. Do you see the cytoplasm? Is it entirely white? No, only this much area around the nucleus, just perinuclear area is coming to be clear. The rest of the area has the pinkish cytoplasm. See, this has all pink cytoplasm. Only the perinuclear clearing of cytoplasm is seen. So just because you see some clear area, don't call it clear cell RCC. Compare the two. Over here, only the slight area around the nucleus is clear. Whereas in clear cell RCC, the entire cell had become white. Completely clear. Guys, this plant cell, well-defined outlines, raisinoid nucleus, perinuclear clearing, that is what is known as a cell seen in chromophobe RCC. And can you see this bluish color stain? These cells are positive for a stain called Hale's colloidal iron, which is an examiner's favorite. Well, uh, obviously, RCC gets you a lot of questions. But from image point of view, these are the questions that you can get for image identification. I hope you'll be writing down the answer of the day. That is, where all do we see Samoma bodies? And yes, that's it for the IOTD. I hope you guys are following the daily schedule. That is 3 p.m. and 10 p.m. on the YouTube channel. 3 p.m. is the microbiology sessions. And 10 p.m. is the IOTD. Also, apart from that, on the Unacademy app, every day morning, 7.45, there's a free special class and that is by the name of Kickstart Mornings where we are daily revising for the upcoming exam. Hope you guys are following the same. Thanks a ton for joining in. Good night.